yes, we can trust the 66 books of the Bible. Uh, we can stake our lives on these books. And the way we come to this conviction, most essentially, is by meeting Jesus Christ in the pages of this book. He stands forth from the pages in the story that has been written in a way that is self-authenticating and compelling. You meet him, he befriends you, he reduces you to a humble brokenness, he reveals himself sufficient for you in his cross, he becomes beautiful and glorious in his living and dying and rising such that you cannot not see the magnificence of the glory and the beauty of Jesus Christ. So there's a spiritual thing that happens here. There's an objective reality that happens there. And when that objective reality and this spiritual transformation meet, light happens and you know that this is true. Now, there are a lot of other objective historical bases and grounds, but when it comes down to an individual coming to deep conviction by which he can die. It, ha it happens at that level of seeing in and through the words and the story to the person of Jesus Christ himself who then vindicates his word in its entirety.